of looks in the front and how the appearance looks. How many know the appearance is, it means a lot? Amen. And I told them guys, they said, Pastor, why are you pulling weeds out of the front? Anybody stop looking in the mirror this morning? Yes, I know sir. You because you're looking good. But you know why you look in the mirror? Because you want to make sure that everything, come here, Brad. You want to make sure that everything is right. See how I'm going to prepare her. Look at this. Her mom could have put a purple bow on her head and just say, girl, go to church. But her mom put the same color of her dress on her. I'm trying to help y'all. Right. The church should look like that. They said, Pastor, why are we pulling these women got 12 bags, Brother Green's 12 bags of mosh. So when you go past there now, I guarantee you. You see Pastor Ben, I'm putting the flower down. That place don't look good. If you want to go somewhere, man, envision yourself and where it's going. Get your do, but I will say inside, you know, have you ever like done some work, Mother Bird, and you think that you just, it was fixed, but then when you uncover some things, you find out that there were some things that need to be fixed. We found a whole lot of yeah. stuff that they just covered up. And you know, uh -huh. It should have been fixed. That's why we have water problems, things like that. Is there anything in your life that's been covered up? All right. You you put the drywall up, but the, but the wood behind the drywall is dry rot. Yeah, yeah. right, right, right. Right. So eventually, Sister David is going to fall. That's yeah. all I got to say on that. And can I tell you, can I tell you all something? I'm telling you right now, those of us who are 50 and older, you know who you are. You, even if you look younger, Brea is not. But eventually, guess what I'm going to have to do? Eventually, God's going to say, turn around, Brea. Put your hand on the back. Okay. Eventually, that's what we're going to have to do. Did you catch that? Turn around and Eventually, I'm trying to help somebody. Right. Eventually, uh huh. The scripture says, I, I, "I was I was young, but now old, oh, and I've never seen the righteous forsaken." But 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 it's, it's, it's almost there. I don't know, Taisha, how long I'm going. I don't know. But God says, "Hey, get ready." When I say get ready, put your hand on the back. Get ready. Get ready. Now, Brad, if you're gonna run, you got to be like this. Yeah. Get down, get down with it. There you go, girl. Now, yeah, you know what, Brad? Because we're training up the young people because they have to know. Can I tell you all something? Anyone ever ran before y'all ever run? I ran track for you. I was kept the track team in 10th grade because I love to run. That's what my son did. He runs. He's a lot better than I am. But you know what it is? You can't just give the baton. The, give it her the baton. Time. When I say it, notice that it's a timing thing. Because you know what? A lot of folk in the church have. Yes, sir. I'm going to say that. Yeah. There are some fathers who have dropped yes, the time. Sir. Mothers who have dropped the time. The church has dropped the time. But prayer, reach. It's the timing. Say timing. Timing. It's time, you all. You can sit down with that prayer. Come on, give God some. Yeah. Tell you all, it's time. It's time. Man, I, I, I'm telling you, get going, Mother Brady. I, Mother Brady, I assure you, on your ninth step. Maybe a few weeks after, we are gonna get you there, my son. Cause I, we got a special seat for you. Man, I'm so so happy, man. Cause I, I, I'm gonna let's praise God for the members and all those saints, the Durdens, the Stricklers, all those people in the Mount Zion Baptist Old Baptist Church that have, have made a place. Let's give them God some praise for them. And we praise God for them. We're going to go ahead and take our...